Hi, I'm Nicole Deason from Microsoft, and I'm here today with Tiffany Wong from Acer, who's joining me to talk about our roles as women in leadership positions, as well as to highlight a few big device announcements at CES this year. Welcome, Tiffany. Hello, Nicole. Thank you for having me. You've taken a special interest in helping women at Acer in particular. Can you talk a little bit about that? So I'm lucky to be in Asia because we have a 30% female manager. So myself and the general legal counsel and the CFO. And uh, I still remember when I back to uh, doing my suppression, I always uh, think about how to not only do for myself, but also for my own function, but also think about how to help others. And if I can small out others, then uh, uh, they can do well and as well as uh, we can do well, same. So, at the end is uh, create a collaborative working together and then really can push a company the a better efficiency, better process. So this is really uh, in my my thinking is uh, think again out of box. Don't do just do it for yourself. So that's my, my story. How about Nicole? Yeah, I love what you said. And you know, for me, creating opportunities for women in our field just feel so fundamental to my work as a leader. And for me, mentorship is a huge part of that. I get so much energy working one-on-one -on -one with aspiring female leaders, and it's my personal goal to help them see what's possible today and then help them find the path to get there. So if I can ask you, being in this male-dominated tech sector, has that ever deterred your, uh, your ambition? You know, I wouldn't say it's deterred me, but of course it's had its challenges. And I'm certain that both you and I have had experiences when we were the only woman in the room. And for me, I think I probably had times where I felt different or uncomfortable. And I sort of had to remind myself that I have as much to contribute to those meetings as anybody else in the room. And, you know, reflecting on those is also a really good reminder to me that it's important to be intentional about inclusion. And that's what really matters. True, true. Uh, actually, I also have a similar, uh, similar experience. I was assigned to join a C-level meeting a long time ago, which before I was in the C-level. And then when I step into the room, and everybody among all the attendees, and of course, I'm the only female. But I didn't uh, let that uh, discourage me. So I really focus on what we should do and then understand partners and needs and also how we can better support them. But after a while, the, the, the strength feeling disappeared and everybody, uh, everything go back to it should be. So I know that Acer and Microsoft have a shared vision for delivering great modern devices for customers. Acer announced several new products this week at CES. Could you tell us a bit about them? So we just announced several new gaming notebook. For example, we will launch a new Predator Triton 300. That pack with a powerful performance and with extended battery life and into a, a portable uh, devices. So if you want to play and work in the same device, that's a perfect device for you. And we are also going to refresh our most popular Predator Helio 300 and the Acer Nitro 5 series. Those are Gamer Noble is going again is uh, with a customized uh, engineer metal uh, aerobrade 3D fans to keep uh, Noble with a cool and a powerful and also Nitro 5 with a cooler boost technology with a better thermal technology performance under the heavy use and also create a sense allow gamer to be able to check the system performance and uh, adjust for their needs. So all those we believe is going to bring uh, uh, another hype for the company and as well as uh, our joint experience uh, to the users. So it's a great uh, honor to be able to work with you and then be able to launch new things. Oh, it's so exciting to see all this innovation coming. Thank you so much, Tiffany, for joining us today and for sharing so many great insights. And thank you everyone for watching. Be sure to check out more announcements to come from CES 2021.